Hi guys, it's me Gwenny back with another um, Shop Spotlight video. So this video is going to be episode number... Um, I think it's going to be episode number 6. So if you haven't watched my videos, um, you probably don't recognize this penguin right here. But, um, so, um... By the way, if this is the first time you're watching my video, hi, hello, my name is Gwenny. I am a washi addict and a sticker addict, and I am just like, I have so much stickers and washi tape, it's not even funny. Um, but yeah, so like, I started this uh, series, uh, I think a few months ago, because at one point I had like, um, too many orders from a certain shop so I decided to just compile them and just put them on a spotlight because I decided since I have so many orders from that shop that must mean that it's one of my favorite shops and that's what this shop spotlight is for is for some of my favorite shops so anyways if um, before I start rambling on and all that stuff so for those of you that do not recognize this penguin this is Pearl the penguin and the shop that I'm going to be talking about in this episode of uh, Shop Spotlight is uh, Green Darner Designs. So Green Darner Designs is a shop owned by Shelly and she is based off of Canada. And a little story is um, I found, I was looking for penguin stickers because if you haven't watched my videos before, um, I'd like to tell you now that me and my husband have obsession with penguins. So. I was like thinking of stickers to put on my planner and I decided I wanted penguin stickers and then I saw that there was like a lot of like um, penguin stickers on the shop so I think it was during one of the sales I can't remember which sale it was but um, I I was I went to I think the Facebook page of the the sale whichever sale it was I went to the Facebook page and asked because sometimes whenever they would have sales they'll have like um, ISO or in search of um, pay, uh, posts so like you type in there which stickers you're looking for so I was looking for a um, sticker of a penguin playing a video game so one of the shops that actually responded was Green Darner Designs and they, she actually put one I have to find a bit um, the sticker to show you um, but like I will show it in the next clip or something like that which sticker that got me into her shop so like there is a lot of like similarities with other shops but so far like Shelly is one of the shop owners that I like to kind of like interact with on Facebook and all that stuff so she is one of my favorite penguin um, sticker shop seller or something like that so I will link her shop in the description box below um, but yeah so hopefully you like this video if you like penguin stickers check out her shop and all that stuff but anyways let's get to the next part okay so the first order that I have this was actually ordered last year 2020 this was ordered um, June 23 2020 and um as i've said in all my videos for the past few months since last year i am working through a backlog of happy mail um what i did during the pandemic was order stickers online and it is crazy um i am still working through it slowly and I still keep ordering more stuff so expect some of this stuff to be still from 2020 it's already 2021 anyways instead of listening to me ramble and make excuses for being a lazy youtuber let's get to this order so this was ordered in um June 2020 and um I love this uh, part right here that um, Shelly does with all the orders. She always puts handmade with love. And I sort of sometimes want to keep it, but at the same time, I, sometimes I tear it open. I tear it off so I can't save it. 
but so this is my order i forgot when i ordered i mean i don't think there was a sale during this time but i think um she came out with something that i really wanted so let's just get to this part so this is one of the samplers I guess this is the June sampler. So there's mom fuel cleaning, mic drop, boom, I did it. <laughs> there's a gardening one. Oh, I can do that for when I'm playing Har um, Stardew Valley. There's a doctor one, a quarter box, half box, a checklist. And then this one says a day at the lake restores the soul. I have never been to the lake, so I'm not sure I'm going to use that one. And I think this is another freebie, so it's got marshmallows, so I think the theme was camping, I guess, when I bought this. I am not an outdoors person, I like the indoors, because bugs love me and I hate bugs. And then I think this is one of the reasons why I got this one. So this one is like, specialist, so um, if you haven't, if this is the first time you're watching my videos, then you probably haven't heard but like I went through like a health thing last year so I pretty much have seen every single person in this thing well I didn't ride a stretcher but I've seen doctors um, I've seen them with masks I've seen surgeons I've seen radiologists so this is really really cute I thought I could use this to mark um, all the stuff that I had I'm still sort of back planning or maybe just for even this year i've already kind of like had a surgeon thing and all that stuff so i'm gonna use this for my planner and then she came out with this marshmallow themed oh, i think it's her um i think it was her sort of like anniversary and i thought this was really cute it says love you s'more so it's got like a cute little marshmallow and a chocolate and this is the back. So this is called a pencil board. So like um, for Hobonichi weeks, since the paper is sort of like, sort of like thin. So you kind of like put the pencil board right here so that when you write, it doesn't go through the, the other side, I think. I think that's what a pencil board is used for. So I can't wait to use that one. And then this is a kit that she came out with. Yeah, this is a Hobo Weeks kit, and I think it is her um, anniversary. So this is called the Love You S'more kit. So there's the date covers. These are the checklist. Um, these are the washi, I think. And here's some kind of like small boxes. Here's some borders and all that stuff. I don't really use most of these. I just use this part right here. But I thought this is really cute. And then there's um, some cute little full boxes. Or, yeah, full boxes for a Hobo Weeks. And there's some icons right here. More washi strips. So this would be really cute. Maybe for, like, the summer? Is that when people go camping? I'm not really sure. And then there's more of these. There's these um, boxes right here. I probably will use this for... The weather on my uh, Hobo Weeks. Um, there's some headers and some more small boxes. Uh, this is really, really cute. So I think I'll use this for the summer. And then the other stuff that I ordered is the social distancing uh, penguins. So this is Pearl. Work from home, which I never do because I work in a hospital. We do not work from home. Um, stay home, wash your hands, which is what you have to do always. Panic buy, we didn't really do that one. Movie night, not today, which is every day. Online shopping, I did a lot of that. Video chat, I did a lot of that too. Social distancing and all that stuff. I thought this was really, really cute. PJs all day, which is me when I'm off. Oh, it's ouch. I think she just got uh, a shot. Oh, that's so cute. So this is what I got. And then I also got this um, Days of the Week. I am addicted to these kinds of, um, what do you call this? Stickers. 
just because I cannot write this pretty so I like it when other people write for me so this is my days of the week um, stickers and that is it for this order so this is like a mini order and I will show you the next clip I'll meet you in the next clip okay so the next thing that I have is another order from 2020 so this one was ordered in October 2020 um, I am so behind So I got this um, order in October, I think, I want to say there was a sale, let me double check my invoice, hmm. I don't know if it was a sale or not, but I, I kind of like, um, what do you call this, one of the things that um, I like about uh, Shelly is all her invoices sort of have like a what do you call this a note so this was the note from the other order so it says thank you Gwen hope you and your family are well love Shelly and then um this one this order for October the note says thank you so much Gwen thank you for inspiring more pearl stickers well wishes to you and your treatment much love Shelly so that was the note um i think i talked about how uh the reason why i found um green darner designs was because i was looking for a i was looking for a gaming sticker which she doesn't carry in her shop anymore um so she kind of um, reached out and asked me if I wanted to actually, thank goodness I have like three of this, uh, two of this sheet. No, three. I think I bought three of it. So now that, you, now that she doesn't have it anymore, I will still be able to use them. But let me just show you the sticker that I, that got me started on Green Darner Designs. It is this one. Isn't this the cutest thing ever? This is Pearl the Penguin and she is holding a controller and she's sitting on a beanie, bean chair, bean bag chair. Um, I don't have bean bag chairs, but I think during this time I was playing when I ordered from her shop, I think I was playing with, I was sharing my husband's Xbox. So that's why I got that sticker. So anyways, I rambled too much, but I just wanted to include that in the video. So this is my order. So this is the sampler that I got. So this was the October sampler. So there's movie night, sick day, which I rarely do. Work from home, which I never do. Wine o'clock. I don't drink much. Insurance, mortgage, I don't need that. But this is a cute little sticker. This is actually like a nice sticker. Hopefully one of these days I will deal with that one but right now I don't and um this one is Colleen's freebie so when you order from her shop she does have PR girls I think the order before the one in July I did not say which PR girl I wanted so I did not get a PR freebie but um if you go to her Facebook group and you join that one there's like a bunch of PR girls there so this time I got Colleen's freebie a cute little gnome and cute little dragon. I forgot the dragon's name. Don't ask me. And then I got this one. This is another freebie. So there's a doctor. Uh, Paul is the guy penguin. Pearl is the girl penguin. So I think this is really, really cute. And then this is cute. I love this. I have like a bunch of Shelly's die cuts. Um, I love, I just love Paul and Pearl the penguin. And this has got a mistletoe, as you can see, it's Christmas time themed. And I ordered this in October, I think. Yeah. So anyway, so this one is the Woodland Fairy. I thought this was really, really cute. And this is a kit. Yeah. So let me show you the kit. Okay, so this is a full kit. 
Um, I, th I just love the colors of this thing. And I'm guessing I'll use this for fall this year. But you got like the washi strips and the date covers and all that stuff and some headers. Um, some full check boxes. Um, these are the full boxes for this kit, which is really, really cute. I love the drawing. Here's some headers and some little bits, odds and ends or whatever you call them. Some half boxes and quarter boxes, which is really, really cute. Um, some weak uh, sidebar thing. Smaller checklist if you don't have that much to do, which is pretty much me. Um, I got some icons and that is the kit that I got. And the next thing that I have is a wash day pearl the penguin so this is i guess another way to mark laundry i have like a bunch of laundry stickers but i like to kind of like um switch them up from time to time so this one is uh hanging the laundry outside so when i grew up in the philippines this is how we dried our clothes we didn't have a dryer so whenever we would wash our clothes we have to hang them on the clothes line so I do have like a kind of like a drying rack thing and I used to put it in the balcony of my apartment but then my apartment complex um sent us a letter that says you're not supposed to do that so so now it's just like uh it's just here um holding on to clothes that we've worn um and then this one is the miss you um sticker so it says wish you were here miss you thinking of you your wings were ready our heart was not so this is like um when somebody passes away so i might have a use for this next month because that would be like my dad's um death anniversary is in april but this is the uh, wherever whoever you hold in your heart is forever and always a part of you you may be gone from my sight but you're never gone from my heart oh this is making me tear up your wings are ready and our heart was not. Those we love don't go away. They walk beside us every day. Grief never ends, but it changes. It's a passage, not a place to stay. Grief is not a sign of weakness or lack of faith. It is the price of love. I love that. Oh, now I'm getting teary-eyed. Sorry, if you hear me sobbing, that's why. Um, And then this one I saw in her shop. Um, So normally on my... Hobo weeks, I doodle the weather. I try to keep track of the weather. Um, so, like, I try to doodle, but sometimes my doodling is not the greatest. So, I thought I'd get these um, these stickers. So, I might use them for this one. Not really sure what I'm going to do yet, but that was my plan. And I guess I bought more of the... I got two of those. And then I guess I bought more of the days of the week. It's the same as the one from the last order. But um, I tend to not, like forget. I am a crazy shopaholic. I tend to forget what I ordered. But I do enjoy these. I do use them for my bullet journal and stuff. So I'm going to get use of that. A lot, use of, a lot of use of that. And then this one is a Hobo Weeks uh, kit. So this one is uh, kind of like a Valentine's Day kit. I have already... Oh, Valentine's fell on the week of um, Lunar New Year this year. So I used a Lunar New Year kit. But I'm thinking I can use this later on. Maybe for my anniversary. Yeah, I think I can use this for my anniversary. This is kind of cute. I might use this. And my anniversary is next week. So I'm going to use that one. And then I also saw that she has these um, hobo date covers. So I got the bold colors. And I think I will use this one. Because I do like covering up the dates. Uh, the, the I do like using date covers on my hobo weeks. So I got a bunch of these. Even though I don't use um, a kit. I do want to be able to cover the dates up. Um whenever so i got a bunch of those so that is my so this was my october order and i will see you in the next clip
Okay, so the next one that I have is the last order I have for 2020. So this was ordered in November of 2020. Um, not a big order. But I think this was from the Made in Canada sale. Um, because Shelly is a Canadian shop. So, um, I don't have as much. So I just, um, let's look at the stickers first and then I'll show you this one thing right here. So... Um, if I can get this open, I love these little heart thingies. So this one is my November order. So I got a freebie. This is Melissa's freebie. So Melissa is one of the PR girls. Um, I do love, like most of the, I think most of my freebies is usually whenever I do remember is Melissa's freebie because I kind of like what she selects as her freebie. So there's weekend. I can't I can't send a swatching. There's a vacuuming, which I hate vacuuming. A snow penguin. Tea time snow day. We actually had this um this year of 2021. So this is the freebie that I got. And then this one is just a regular freebie. So there's a birthday, order online, another vacuuming, I hate vacuuming, there's another snow, like a cute little pearl all bundled up, a pearl <laughs> online shopping, and then, um, so like she comes up with this, whenever there's a, um, whenever there's a sale, she always has like, um freebie if you reach a certain amount and stuff like that but like normally whenever she does that i don't buy everything so i would have like random um pieces of a kit but i think lately she started sort of like offering to be able to buy the whole kit when you order so i think this was like the tiered freebies for this sale so there's the date covers and this is called it just says made in Canada November. And then this one is the the full boxes and some um regular stickers. It says it's red cup season. Um here's another full box. Oh, this is the same as the other one. Um Oh, I guess I reached a certain amount of freebies, so I got two of these. And then this is the rest of the kit. So this is the most wonderful time of the year. Maybe I'll use this for this year. I'm not sure. But this is really cute. I might use it for my bullet journal. And then the other sticker sheet that I got is the COVID shopping. So it's got like Pearl and uh, Paul wearing masks while shopping. So there's groceries, shopping for toilet paper. Um, regular shopping bags. This is how we shop right now. And then the other one is just this PJs all day. I thought this is really, really cute. I don't wear PJs. I wear a nightgown. But this is still cute. I can mark it whenever I'm home on my day off. And I don't have to go anywhere. So this is what I'll be wearing. So those are all the stickers for this order. And then this one, when she came out with this, cover for this photo uh for the sticker album i knew i had to get it so let me see oh i was able to save that one for sort of um what you call it so let me get this sticker album off or the plastic bag off so this is um sticker album this is like my second sticker album from her the other one was kind of like a hobo week size i decided to try and get this size so this is the just a girl with goals i thought this was the cutest cover that's why i got it oh it looks like i have cracks but that's okay you can't really see it i just feel it but i thought this is the cutest thing it says just a girl with goals and you get like green darner design. And then this is the back of the thing. And it fits the sticker sheets 
exactly so I can put all my um, green darner uh, stickers the problem is I have a lot of green darner stickers right now so I doubt they would fit in this one or maybe they do I'm not sure I'll have to double check and see um, I might have to kind of rearrange them and put them in this sticker book that way I know which um, which sticker book I will reach for if I want pearl the stickers but yeah I just gotta fill it up I guess when I fill it up it'll get it'll close better right now it's sort of like hard to close but I guess when it gets filled I'm not sure how many pages these thing is but hopefully it'll be enough for my pearl and Paul collection right now and that is it for my November order so one more order after this and that's the end of the video so I will see you in the next clip okay so the next order that I have is from February of this year 2021 um, this is another made in Canada collaborative sale so a bunch of Canadian shops have a sale and Green Donner Designs always gets it always gets my money during the sale um, so um, this is one of the things that I was talking about like um, normally if you reach a certain amount you get like a certain freebie um, for the thing but you also get the option of buying it so I bought the kit for the sale um, but this is one of the freebies that I got so there's appointment get this done there's a pearl with a bunch of stickers um, I love this full box right here. This is the theme of the the freebies that she has for the Made in Canada collaboration sale. Plan all the things in this cute little dino. Um, this is date covers. Look at how pretty it is. I love it. I love the colors and I love the night sky. Um, there's more full boxes. And then these ones are, oh, it's Alien Abduction Day? Was that yesterday? Yeah, that was yesterday. I didn't know that. And then there's April 14th is Look Up at the Sky. World Penguin Day is April 25. I need to mark that on my calendar so I will not forget. Oh, that is so cute. Um, this one is a February freebie. So Winnie the Pooh was the uh, one of her new releases for the sale was Winnie the Pooh and I had to get it because I love Winnie the Pooh but there's a bee a penguin in a bee suit um, St. Patrick's Day um, I'm not lost for I know where I am but ho however where I may be for however but however where I am may be lost okay, I, that kind of like went over my head but there's paint night. I can use that to mark um, diamond painting. I don't do paint painting, but I do diamond paintings. So I got the kit for the Winnie the Pooh. It's called the Oh Bother kit. Um, I got the glitter headers. I got the deco stickers, because why not? Winnie the Pooh is so cute. I can kind of like relate to him, because we both have the same belly. Um, this is the kit right here so this is the bottom washi and the date covers and some more glitter headers um, some check uh, check boxes full check boxes um, these are the full boxes for this the kit I thought this is really cute look at Eeyore and there's Winnie the Pooh with the bees and his honey is it her honey? I forgot. Um, the little th the headers and the little things. Um, weekend banner and the, all the half boxes and the quarter boxes. The sidebar stuff and the icons. And some more small checklists. So that is the O Bother kit. And then, let me show you this part right here first. So this was the full uh, kit for the sale so I guess I reached like tier 2 when I bought stuff so that's why I have these two 
but like if you reach a certain amount you get this page or well, maybe I got this page and then if you reach the full amount you get this whole page so I did not reach this one I only got to tier 3 normally I just get up to tier 1 but I did get to tier 3 um, so now I have doubles of these and then this one is the full box for if you reach a certain uh, amount. So it says stars can't shine without darkness. So that's really nice. And there's got like, uh, I made the force be with you, Star Wars themed. That's really, really cute. I love Star Wars. And this is really cute. I love this. Two dinos together watching something on the laptop. So that's really, really cute. I love this kit. And then I also got the Hobo Weeks version of this kit because like I said, I really love Winnie the Pooh. So I got another set of deco sheets. So this is a little bit smaller than the other one. No way, it's the same size. So I got two of these. This is really, really cute. And then I got the side, the date covers and the checklist and these small um, stickers. And then um, these are like the bottom washing, I think. And then these are the full boxes. I thought this is really, really cute. And here's some washi strips, um, habit trackers. I never use habit trackers anymore because I really suck at developing habits. These are the um, boxes for the other side that I'm probably gonna use for weather. I love these um, big things right there. I guess it's like, if you have like a notable event, you can just write it down on the side. Something good that happened that day. So that is the kit, the Hobo Weeks kit. And then if you buy, I think, the ultimate one, you also get the pencil. Um, what do you call this again? I had it in the other clip. The pencil board. That's what it is. And this one is the so cute um, Winnie the Pooh. As soon as I saw you, I knew an adventure was going to happen. So that's a quote from Winnie the Pooh. And this is him at the back. Him or her at the back with the balloon. So that's really, really cute. And then I got this sticker right here. It says organize stickers. So I'm always doing this because if you could see my table after I do or film my hauls, you would scream if you're uh, a neat freak, because I am not a neat freak. And half the time, my, my table would be covered. You won't be able to see this part. You'll just see stickers, washi tape everywhere. So, this is like a common theme. Just before I film, I have to do this part. I have to organize so that I can put away everything that I just filmed. And then with this order, I actually ordered a dammit bag. So, if... I think I've ordered a damn it bag before, but if you haven't heard of damn it bags, these are actually sort of like Shelly's version of oops bags or uh, misfit bags. So it's like stickers that didn't pass her quality control. So she like, um, she just gathers them and just I guess she has a pile somewhere and then whenever she get she the pile um, gets a little bit fuller she will kind of like put them in the bag and sell them so this is the glucometer diamond bags so I'm not really sure what's damn it about it I mean the sticker unless it's the color so these are all like glucometers so aside from uh, aside from being a cancer patient, I am also a diabetic, so I do check my blood sugar every day. So this would come in handy in my planner. Um, so I got different colors, so that would be good. I do like that. So now I have a bunch of them. Yeah, I don't see anything damn it about this. So why are they called damn it? Damn it, sheets. Yeah, it's like a male oopsie grab bag. Huh. I don't know. Doesn't look damn it to me. But I am glad to have it. Most of the time, whenever shops have like 
um, oops bags or misfit bags or something like that. There's only like minute um, errors in them and stuff like that. Either they're off center, the color is not right. So they're still usable stickers. It's just that, um, what do you call this? They did not pass the quality control of the shop owner. So that's why they are discounted and sold for a price. So this is my last order um, for this haul video. And like I said, I love Green Darter Designs. Shelly is one of my favorite shop owners. I have like a bunch of favorite shop owners, but most of them, uh, Shelly is one of those owners that I actually sort of like interact with in her Facebook group. She's really good at answering or reacting or commenting on your comments and stuff like that. I really love that about her. And I also love that she adds like a note to your order so I just really love that small touches so Shelly if you're watching this video I love you thank you for making all the Pearl and Paul stickers and these cute little kits um, I really do love them especially that like that gamer Pearl is like one of my most precious sticker um, one of my most precious sticker sheet so thank you for making that one anyways that is it for this haul video um thank you so much for watching and i will see you next time bye guys